Oh! oh. Panic crab, whoa! Oh, what? YouTube, good morning. It's Saturday morning, bright and early, rise and shine, SoCal. We're out here in sunny California on the way to the Los Angeles Coliseum for the final round of the Super Motocross World Championship that's all in the United States. Playoff Championship Series, final round, should be good. Tons of money on the line, no pressure or anything. Can't wait to see it. Been doing no access all year, as you guys know. Today we got a band it actually says, says we actually have some track access today so we're actually going to try to get some footage from the floor today and uh, maybe just do a little bit of a vlog type deal today not so much raw footage just kind of get some of the sights and the sounds behind the scenes of the la coliseum smx should be a good one we got riders out here in the rental car that's way out of our league you guys already know we don't travel in things this nice usually freaking push to start that's right baby got a hell of a story about acquiring this rental car though buckle up i booked a rental car off expedia for pretty cheap i thought i'd gotten lucky got a nice cheap car rental i get off the plane head to the place wait in line for like an hour finally get up to the counter and then i realized you can only do a deposit with a credit card for a rental car now why i'm getting penalized for using money that i actually have is beyond me i feel like i got the shaft there i don't even have a credit card i just use a debit card so wasn't able to get a car there. I thought I was pretty much like stranded in LA. Took a shuttle back to the airport, got on Turo, tried to get a car from Turo, booked a car from Turo, but then they wouldn't get back to me, so I was still stranded. Canceled that one, booked another Turo car, and it told me to take a shuttle to this location, and then they would have a shuttle to pick me up to bring me to their location. I took the shuttle to their location and then just sat there for like 30 minutes in downtown LA with my head on a 360 degree swivel, just waiting to get mugged or shot or something like that. Luckily it all buffed out, I'm still here, but stayed there for like 30 minutes. Is this one time at band camp? What, what Asking the people what was going on, I texted the number they told me to text, I wasn't getting any answer. Finally, after like 30, 35 minutes, they messaged me and told me I need to come to their location because the shuttle is only from like 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. even though I requested it before 10 p.m. but that's neither here nor there so finally got an uber to the location went to their storefront was finally about to be dialed in I thought things were good to go but of course another wrench in the program is in the contract always I go to get my car and they told me the person before me hadn't returned it yet so they had to switch me back out that took a while finally got in my car and uh, didn't get back to where I was staying until about two in the morning. Uh, if you guys want a mental account on how not to get a rental car, there you have it. <laughs> Dumbass. With all due respect to the city of Los Angeles, actually never mind, no respect even needed. This place is a shit hole. We got people living in tents and boxes off the sides of the streets. Traffic beyond what I've ever seen. Average speed is like six miles an hour. If there wasn't a race here, you wouldn't catch me within seven states of this place. Behind the scenes, Dino Tube. This is what goes into it, folks. We got track walk going down right now. Clearly, it's not all that exclusive of a privilege, but I, my zero access self, still ain't allowed. The wristband literally says track access. And they told me I can't do track walk. Tell me how much sense that makes, please. Maybe I'm missing something, I don't know. All right, y'all, we're supposed to have track access. I've been getting denied so far. We're gonna still try to make a break for it. I'll be damned, here we are. We made it. Got unseated coming off. Yo, baby! Double super fan!
like Roost as much as super fan that hurts. Boy, must have been to the top. I can't see the board from here. Oh yeah, I guess I can. Just didn't look. We're feeling dangerous. First practice. Stuff getting his OnlyFans content. No toys. for access I've had enough I was out on the track for one practice and got kicked back out not allowed to go in any gates got to go all over the freaking place to even just get in and walk got 450a group out there I just don't get to see it whatever all good <laughs> Back in the stand, zero access, front row. We got Noah Viney. I think he reposted my video at like five in the morning. Rhino had him up watching the sunrise. No choice. Oh, man. Gavin Towers, you need a lawyer on speed now, brother. Idea, Lord. We can probably self-defend on that one. Oh, come on, go for the takeout. You messed up your lap. Oh! People 
just totally ruined that shot, but we got a collision. They're down. Oh. We got a fake start coming at us, unseated 250s. I could have sworn the start was the sketchiest part of the race, but yeah, let's just do some more for no reason. And it's freshly watered. Thoughts and prayers to these guys. This could get hairy for no reason, I might add. Stop me if you heard that before. We reluctantly crouched at the starting line, and they're off. Look at Yoder. Yanking it. We got somebody yelling. I like their style. Yoder versus Freckle. Panic grab. Whoa! They came together. We're having a conversation about it. Yoder's made both lanes so far. Out of the LCQ, he's got a chance at some better tonight if he puts it in for a third straight. Whoa! Where's the lawyer? That call up park in both lanes as well out of the LCQ. Oh boy, looking for the chat. Check out his vlog too. He's got some funny banter out there. Call up park on the two, but not. Oldenburg, you skip the first two rounds. We're out here for a last ditch effort to get the cash. It's triple points tonight, so he's got a good chance at it. He's got to get through to the show. Out of his LCQ. It's like storming the beaches of Normandy at 250 LCQ out here. Also, shout out to Luke Nees, freshly engaged. Congratulations, brother. He's got the 285. Is that Marshall Wellman, Tony Archer, or Tony Stock? I don't know. Gotta have some PTSD from this wall though. He went straight into one earlier in the year, just like myself. Oh, they that's touch his teammate. air. Yeah, that's his teammate. Oh, Colin no. Park. Oh, look, he's out of control. Oh. oh. Roddy Wade wins another one that came out last ditch effort for the cat. Skip the first two rounds. Should just give me the triple points. I'll do what I need to do. Riding for Team Solitaire, home to the best winner of a moto team in history. They are incredible. We got the zombie, Chris Close, picked up a Phoenix Honda ride. I haven't seen him at any main events yet, though. He caught a charge at the first one. He got third in the LCQ, but got docked for a track cut. This dude just retires, unretires, re-retires, comes back after. Zombies never die, they just come back to action without a choice in the world. Another fake start, absolutely none of the marbles. Look at the rider D, yes! We'll get the whole shot when it's time, he's been yanking like all of them. Frenchy about pulled and swept around. It's the French power slide.
on top. What is going on? This pole's about as long as his neck. It's a nice resemblance there. Maximus doing the roll lap. That's what you get to do when you're on top. I do roll laps when I'm T40, not ideal. Jacob and RJ, we got the vets. Pierce Brown, shit up spoiler mode. P3, we haven't heard much from him in a while. 450 seed in the take star. Look at AP, look at the jump. Oh, he got motored though. Look at Coop. Just out of the left cheek. March man, he's a rip. Yeah. The guy just made for the 450. What did you used to call him the man child for nothing when he was a kid? We got a million dollars on the line for these guys tonight. No pressure or anything. Chase has been raking it in this year. I know he wants to pat the pockets a little heavier. Could always use another beach house, another car. AC going so fast for a dude whose arm and shoulder are probably dumb. What a legend. No need to be able to feel the grip. It's right at ease. Then we got another one of our contenders, Roxton. He ain't as worried about the money though. He just got a baby gift from Jet, so he's sitting pretty. I think Chase would have to get third if Penny wins to put the Kickstarter on top. Maybe he would use a million to invest in Suzuki R&D to get some electric start on the whip for next year. Then we got the jet. Dude's rolling in so much cash. He's giving away race wins for the hell of it. That's what happens when you win 96 motos in a row. We're under fire from the fans after how we took our loss from Roxton. He says he needs to learn to lose. We got Master Bull still racing with appendicitis. The legend of all legends. Yeah, all right, that was cool. Jets in like eighth gear, and then we got Barsha just foul floating his life away back here. Yeah. Coop has got to be it. I know my boy ain't out here to not win, or at least podium. He's gonna have the fire tonight, I can feel it. We got Dino out here doing it for the tube. I saw exclusive behind the scenes of that earlier today. Come on, AP, idiot! It's only 30 seconds left. Yep. AP just donated 10 grand to the Muddy Creek Cody Drag Two Stroke Memorial Race. Thank you to AP. What a class act. What a guy. Who does that anymore? AP does. Well, 45 is too big there. Maybe that's all we need. Get Bruce to buy Barsha. Yeah. Ready! Ooh, the wheelie truck getting iffy with it. Oh, the loop out. Whoa! Quad on off? Has everybody been doing that? Jesus Christ. I told you guys Coop was fired up. He's never on the board in practice. P3, let's go. Unseen at 450. He's got Philbin Phil, 69. You already know he's got the middle finger on standby for this unseated group. Off. 
He's been ripping SMX though. He's an SMX god. He's found his calling. 444, Roman Pave or Justin Summers. The world may never know. Then we got Cartwright. LC2 Challenge winner. He might qualify for this. He works IT. Dude's just taking everybody's money. We got Jeremy Hand. He's got a shot for cash as well. 25k just to get last in points in there. Got Slime, Devin Simonson from SX to MXGP to SMX. Dude didn't even know he was racing this until like that morning or something. Only fans, Jinx Kessler doing it for the porn stars. Light Shelly from Loretta's to SMX. What a trajectory. Moran's Mafia adding new features to the Patreon between practices. Let's go, J-Rob. Come on. My boy needs this 25 G's. Oh man, Kessler threw him for a loop. Staying in it though. We got the Bobby Piazza bike rev station. A super fan would say check for irritable bowel syndrome. Simonson's a suspect. That's right, rabbit float him. Folks, I have literally not been told I cannot go so many places in one day in my entire life. I was just trying to walk through the damn bleachers. Couldn't even walk through the bleachers without getting yelled at. I'm starting to wonder where I even can go. I really hate to be one to come. Whoa, Ryder down. I was just trying to make a point. Shoot out again. We're just trying to walk through the bleachers. Stay there in that position on the podium because he knew. Had access for all of 12 minutes today. Now we're back to zero. I guess this is just meant to be though. It's the way she goes. We got Joe Blow, mother, brother, cousin, grandpa, and dog all getting to do track walk. We're chilling up here. No choice. Not better at all. Okay, yeah, I am. Oh man, I think those are the Hangtown dirt diggers out there with water hoses. They gave us a straight up slip and slide at Hangtown this year. This is worrisome for the competition. That's right, slick it up, baby, like tire shine on a Walmart floor.